All right, let's jump into it. Hope everyone's doing well, staying positive. Well, this was supposed to be two videos, ended up being one. Still probably gonna have four or five videos to this project. This is day three and four, and a little bit of day five. So we're gonna be pouring about 2,800 square feet of concrete. It's gonna be a broom finish. We also got about 240 square feet of stamp concrete. You'll see later on in the next video. So here we have our laser out. We establish our proper grade. We're gonna stay one foot along the perimeter of the fence all the way around. And in the back of the artificial turf is gonna create a walkway. Layout for the artificial turf changed a couple of times. Here we're making sure our measurements line up with the new layout. So my son's still showing up, which is pretty good. Anybody with a teenager know how hard it is to get these guys off the game. By us being down one guy, he really stepped it up this week. <laughs> of course he's gonna ask for more money though. Be sure to stay to the end of the video where you get a sneak peek of us pouring the concrete. Now that we established our grade, we'll throw up a string line about every 15 feet. So from the top of the string line, which is the top of the concrete, we're about seven inches down. We'll bring in about three inches of base rock, which will be compacted, and the last four inches will be concrete. So part of day five and six, we brought in close to 40 yards of base rock. Had to tell my son, yo, there's a technique to it. Don't just dump it in the big pile. As you dump, slowly move back with the machine. That boy was making me work hard. I think about the sixth trip though, he finally got it. Now it's all about getting the proper grade. That's where the string light played its role at. Once that is established, it's time for us to vibrate the bass rock. As you can see, the rebar is here. We use number three at 16 inches on center. Leave a comment below to guess how many pieces we use. While you're down there, be sure to like and subscribe to our channel. We greatly appreciate it. Now the sound you hear is not the Terminator, it's the sound of our rebar tying gun. This is a true time saver. Now, that about wraps it up for this video. Be sure to subscribe to our channel to be the first one to see us pouring this patio. I know we got a lot going on in the Bay lately. With the fires, 19, the kids still at home. Just remember to stay positive and it's cool to ask for help. Oh yeah, a glass of wine will help also. If you're in the Bay Area, Sacramento, hit us up for a free estimate. Make it a good one.